Did you know Draw.io isn't all diagramming? When you're using Draw.io, boards are able to write and doodle on the canvas as well. Hey, it's Emily, and in today's video, we're going to be going over the best ways to utilize the brush tool in Draw.io. Let's say I want to take quick notes on a diagram, or roughly mark up a whiteboard. I'll start by clicking on the little pencil icon in the left toolbar. Or you can access freehand mode by pressing X on your keyboard. We can change the size of the brush by dragging this slider in the freehand panel, or quickly switch to a thin pen-like tool by deselecting the brush box. Once you're done with your drawing, stop the drawing mode, and you can modify it just like any other object in Draw.io, like increasing or decreasing the size. Change the color, thickness, and other aspects of your drawing by using the Style tab in the Format panel. The brush tool is especially powerful when used to annotate and comment on charts and diagrams. Tell your team that you like the higher numbers this year, or that this line is confusing. The brush tool allows for cleaner, more efficient collaboration of ideas with your team. And finally, you can keep your work and doodles separate by using layers. First, you'll want to add a new layer. Select it, and draw away. From now on, you can toggle your sketches on and off to always keep the original work untouched. To learn more about layers in Draw.io, click the card in the top right corner now, or check out the description below for the link. I hope you all found this video helpful, and make sure to subscribe to keep up with our latest content that will help you with all your diagramming questions. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.